Number four. Fred and George's swamp was still in the school when the trio's kids got there. Truth. And I think it would have just been one of those things where it was left there and people just kept walking past it and eventually it just became accepted as one of those things that was there and nobody really knew why anymore. And there was like all kinds of like weird urban legends about what happened. And um, nobody actually knows the truth anymore. But yeah, I think... I don't know why they would have taken it down if they didn't take it all the way down the, the first time. In the first place. Yeah, it's my headcanon that... Well, one, truth, it's still there. But maybe not a swamp. I could see them turning it into a nice fountain. And maybe having it be a memorial to Fred. Who died at Hogwarts during the Battle mm-hmm. of Hogwarts too. Mm-hmm. So I do think people like would know why it's there. Um, I don't, again, think it is a swamp or disgusting type of eyesore type of thing. Uh, I think maybe it gets fixed up a little bit. And I think that George would probably be the one that goes in to kind of clean it up too and make it something nice for his brother as a little in memoriam type of deal. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going truth too. I was thinking the same thing, Joe. I think it would be a really, a nice memorial to Fred. I think the only reason that it wouldn't still be there is if it was destroyed in the Battle of Hogwarts at some point. Like if it just got blasted and and blown up or something, yeah. Hmm. Um, but I, a giant, <laughs> right? Uh, but I don't think so. I think I think I think it's still there, and it's probably got a nice plaque. Or it's, I think it's still a swamp because I think Fred would want it to be a swamp. But I think it's still there. 